All right, next one is going to be one-on-one -on -one Marquette. So that's when we need the two chairs, guys. And I'll, you know, I'll give I'll give Coach Williams all the credit. In the I, I got this from him at a clinic, geez, a couple years ago. Um, you know, he he believes in a lot of one-on-one, -on -one, two-on-two drills, um, and he does this with his uh, with his Marquette uh, Golden Eagles, I guess they are now, rather than Warriors. Um, I'll always call them the Warriors. But what what this drill does is again, it's a one-on-one -on -one defensive drill, and it's got a couple tweaks. So we call this one-on-one -on -one half. These are basically kind of like cousins of each other as far as drills go. They're very, very closely related, but um, they do a couple of separate things. All right, so chairs, managers, whatever you got handy, put one here, put one here. And what's nice about this drill, you know, you can move it. You can put it on the wing. Maybe you're not doing well in wing defense. Maybe you're not doing well in baseline. Maybe you're not doing well in the middle of the court, whatever. You know, we're basically just doing it on the side because it's the easiest to show. Um, so what's going to happen... Is Drew's gonna Drew's gonna dribble around away from the basket is what I always refer to with the guys, a, away from the basket. He's gonna attack the rim, okay. And Brett's gonna do the same thing away from the basket, come around and play defense, okay. So I'm gonna just move these up a little bit, okay. And then they're gonna go one on one. This guy sprints on the defensive end. He shouldn't get a shot in the paint, okay. There shouldn't be there should be no shot in the paint if he's doing a good job. All right, let's try this. Ready? Go. Dribble around. There you go. Go, 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 go. Good. Let's do it again. And what, we, what you can do if you have more kids, hold on one second. If you have more kids, you have more people available. Um, you know, what I like about all these drills is sometimes we have VR games and we only have five or six guys at practice. I can do every one of these drills with five or six guys. You know, people are off the, you know, if you're a youth coach or you're something, you don't have a lot of guys or people are sick, you can run all these. The, the adjustment is you can put a couple defenders over here, an offensive guy, defensive guy. You know, you can be creative with these drills. I'm just showing the basic premise behind this. But you can put two, you can put a chair here and a chair here, put one on offense, one on defense, go two on two. You can do three on three. All these things are kind of expandable. Um, all right, so go ahead, go. Good, don't reach. Very good. Look at that vertical jump. Wow. You, Anago, what, what, was your ma, what was your mascot? Anna, Red, Robins. Red Robins, the Anago Red Robins. Look at that vertical jump. So that was really good as far as getting around the chair and, and attacking. Okay, so we can do all of those things. The, the, another one, and it's kind of along the same lines, and so grab that chair, put it at the elbow for me, guys. And again, we call this, you know, we call this one-on-one -on -one Marquette. I guess it's basically the same name, but um, they kind of know when I set the chairs up here what we're doing. So I have the ball on this one. Let me put my uh, plan away here. All right, and it's the same thing. It's a one-on-one -on -one drill. They're going outside the chairs, away from the basket, away from the basket. And I'm going to throw the ball to them. Now, what usually we'll do is, again, if we have a lot of kids, we'll put some down on that end, some on this end, and we'll change it up a little bit. This is a fun drill. There's no rules. Okay, no out of bounds, no rules, people are diving, whatever. Okay, so we'll do this slow-mo. Okay, so you guys are going to go on the outside of the chairs, and then I'm going to throw the ball to somebody, and then as soon as I throw that, he's on offense and then defense. Okay, all right, here we go. Now, how often do I throw the ball like that? Not very often. Okay, you know, I'm going to throw the ball off the ceiling, I'm going to take a shot, I'm going to roll it, I'm going to do all sorts of different things to kind of make it difficult, because a good drill makes it harder than game, and, uh, and it's kind of fun. They like this drill, um, you know, this was a new one that we kind of did this year a little bit, and they, they seem to really like it. All right, now don't run into each other or kill each other when you do this, because you can, 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 can get pretty violent at times, and uh, there could be some, con con ah, I can't talk. There can be some uh, head collisions and those kind of things. All right, ready, go. Good. Good shot. Get a hand up on that, all right? And then, like I said, you vary it up. Go. Oh, now, if that happens, and I didn't actually, I didn't actually mean for that to happen, if I make the shot, I always tell them, if I make the shot, it's a miss. No matter when we're doing a drill, if I make it, I banked it off. So um, 
they, we keep going. Okay, if the ball bounces out of bounds, we're going to keep going. Doesn't matter. All right, ready? Go. See if I miss that one. There we go. And then they're going to go live, one on one. Okay, last one here. Okay, now be careful. Ready? Go. There we go. There's that vertical. Good. So again, it's just, you know, making it fun. You know, we usually have some contests. We'll, you know, have guys go against each other. You know, we've done tournaments with that. You know, that can be kind of a fun drill. And again, just pick the elbows because it was easy to show and demonstrate. But, you know, we can do the wings. You can do those other things, and it's, and it's pretty straightforward. All right? So we call, that, we call those two drills one-on-one uh, -on -one Marquette.